Hello there, again, this is Ryan and 31 I have not retrieved my mic, again, so sorry, anyway. I have researched more on the new game Hitman Absolution and have found some confirmed information. Some websites are also quite useful, like wikipedia.org, right here it has some facts. I will further read with what is visible in the green and red rectangle. The link will be in the description. Though plans to continue the Hitman franchise were first announced in 2007, it was not until May 2009 that Eidos confirmed the game was in development. Certain plot details for the game were rumored in 2009, stating that the game's story would lead Agent 47 to a low point from which he would have to rebuild himself. On 20 April 2011, Square Enix filed the trademark for the name Hitman Absolution in Europe, leading sites to speculate that it would be the name of the fifth Hitman game. On 6 May 2011, a teaser trailer was released, confirming the title, Hitman Absolution. The short, 27-second trailer briefly showed Agent 47 attaching a suppressor and a rattlesnake coiled around his signature silver ball or pistol. It has been reported the game will be familiar and yet significantly different experience from other Hitman games. Now for the confirmed information. Agent 47's handler, Diana Earnwood, has a close relationship with 47 in Absolution. So they tricked us in the trailer to make us believe 47 was going to kill her. Obviously. Secondly, the main antagonist is revealed to be Blake Dexter, a new character to the series. The character will be voiced by Keith Carradine. Thirdly, it has been confirmed by the developers that the game is only going to be set in the United States, with one portion taking place in Champaign, Illinois. Other locations are unconfirmed. But that's confusing, because in the art it showed 47 in different police outfits, so it's obviously going to be outside of America. More importantly, the game will be released around 2012. Players will be able to set up elaborate traps. Holy shit balls. That sounds cool. There will be a moment in the game which will divide fans into two distinct groups. What does that mean? Something annoying? Anyway, that's as far as I got. Thank you for watching.